Hey guys, how's it going? I just wanted to make a quick video here um, on Game Ranger. Um, my, some of my friends had problems installing it and getting it all set up, so I wanted to make a quick video um, going over this. Um, so you're gonna get the actual program uh, just from GameRanger.com. Uh, you can just install it there, um, and you'll open up to this. And it may look a bit confusing at first, um, but I promise it's not as crazy as it looks. Um, to add your friends, you're just gonna go to this little friends bar here and just hit the plus button. And then you can find them by their name, their email, their nickname, whatever. Um, but once you add them, it actually doesn't let the other person know that you added them. Uh, they have to go ahead. Uh, they have to actually find you and add you back. Um, it's kind of weird, but that's how it works. So then you can see your friends here. Um, so how you're going to actually get into a game, that's where it gets a little tough. Um, so you can join other people's hosted games right here. Um, you can also sort them... Um, by the category right here, uh, so if it's an action game, classic, simulation, strategy, or my games, ones that I own, um, and we'll have it over here, who's joining, they'll have some more information on this, um, but if you wanted to host, uh, you'll click host right here, um, and you'll select the game that you own, uh, whichever one it is, um, and so let's say, let's say we want to do a Star Wars Battlefront one, uh, so we'll click that, and um, you'll choose how many players you want to be able to join you. Um, so there you go. You can also add a password, add allow trade late joiners, allow friends only, a gold and silver accounts only. That's if you pay for it, um, which I don't. So we go ahead and hit OK to host that. I'm going to come up with this here. And now this is the problem um, with hosting games over at Game Ranger. Uh, your router has to be able to port forward. And uh, since I'm renting a house, um, my router is not able, I'm not allowed to edit the Wi Fi or anything here. Uh, so I'm not able to do that. So I actually can't host for friends. I have to have someone else do it. Uh, so if this message comes up, don't freak out. Uh, you can still play with other people. Uh, just make sure that you're not hosting if this happens. Um, it'll not work and nothing will work and it's super frustrating. Uh, so you'll hit continue here. Um, and what it's going to do is it's going to open up this really extremely loud ad, um, which is always annoying. They always play it. Let's see. Let's see. Um, basically, once you're in that hosting room right there uh, just go to the friends bar and hit um, add friend and uh, so once you're in that menu just right click on a friend click invite and they can come to the game and they'll join it and then when you're ready you just hit start on the actual uh, hosting screen here let me show you real quick here sorry that ad was too loud I closed it out uh, here we go so you'll go ahead and click invite to game what you if you them, knew come in you could make hit. this holiday you'll hit that start button there on the bottom right and uh, that will actually launch the game and uh, go into the lobby and your friend will be able to join you too. So that's how you do Game Ranger. Um, it sometimes is a little bit sketchy on how it actually works um, but it seems to work most of the time and uh, it's way better than having no servers at all. So hopefully this helped you guys out. Uh, ask any questions in the comments below and I'll probably do a few more videos uh, going over Game Ranger too. So hopefully this helps.